Hey, what's up? I'm back with another episode of What is in the Bag, where I ask my wife to find something, anything at the store that she thinks would be interesting for me to try and eat, and you get to watch it live. Now, someone suggested that I should do the initial taste test completely blind. So that's what I'm going to do. So I've got this. This is my, this is actually like my sleeping mask, but it's pretty cool. It's got like a Bluetooth headphones in it and everything. So I'm going to throw that on. I've got a, a trash can close by and I've got some water because I have no idea what to expect here. So let's see what she's got me today. It feels heavy. Uh, it feels round. Oh God. No, this is going to be something in a can, like some type of dead something. We don't have a pretty bag today, I guess. It just feels like a plastic, plastic bag. What the heck? How many bags is it in? Okay. Oh, no. Well, I don't know what it is, but I can't, I can't open it without a can opener thing. Come on, Dawn. What do I? I'll find a way to do this. Okay, so I'm blindfolded back up and I got a can opener. I haven't looked at anything. Here's the can. I'll try to show it to you so you get a look, good look at whatever is about to be in store for me before I try to open this thing. Oh, 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 I think maybe. I have no idea if anything's happening right now. It feels like I'm doing something. Did I do anything? Oh no, are you supposed to like grab onto the lid? I think I remember this can opener having some kind of grippy. Oh, come on. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna wrap the bag around the outside so I can't see this. And I'm just gonna try to look real quick to figure out how to get the dang lid off. I just have to grab on to, this was the thing I was looking for. There's some like little jaws. Okay, okay, okay. You know what? This feels, oh God. It, it feels like some kind of like processed meat product. And there's probably juice in it. I mean, that's what, that's what I'm getting the feeling of. I want to remove the can. I'm gonna try to smell it a little bit. Oh gosh, that smells bad. Oh no. Oh no, that smells like some kind of egg something or another. Oh no. Oh my gosh, that definitely smells like something related to an egg. Oh no, what, what kind of egg would come in a can? I am concerned about this. Oh man, I'm just gonna stick my, I don't even know what, like, do I just stick my fingers in there? I, God, it smells like an egg. What is this? What the heck? What on earth? What is this? What is this? What shape is this? I don't even know what shape this is. It feels like a eyeball or something. Oh my God, what have you done, Dawn? Oh man. Oh man, I am very concerned about this. <laughs> okay, okay, all right, here goes. Oh God, oh, 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 what is that? Oh, whoa, oh no. Ah! Ah! What the heck is that? Oh no! Oh, it was like it was like gristly, and then it, <laughs> it felt it felt like something popped. It didn't have a whole lot of flavor, but oh, what is that? Oh no! Okay, I'm gonna find out what it was I just stuck in my mouth. What the heck? Escargo! Huh! No! Giant snails? No wonder I couldn't figure out why it had like different textures. Oh my gosh.
Look at that. Cause it's got like, I guess the part of it that like sticks to stuff and the other, the rest of it that comes out of the body and it's cold. Like, ah, oh, wouldn't you, uh, wouldn't you at least like warm these things up or something? One dozen giant snails. What does the thing say? Oh, preparation. Drain contents and place a snail in each shell, which has been rinsed in boiling water. Cover with butter sauce, as in the recipe below. Place the prepared snails in a hot oven until snail butter is bubbling. Yeah, they're supposed to be cooked. I just ate one straight out of the can and I didn't even have any butter sauce. See, but this says, drain the contents and place a snail in each shell. What shell? Am I just already supposed to have snail shells? Or, or is it like a separate purchase? That is one thing I don't have laying around, is snail shells. I don't have that. Was there supposed to be like a combo pack or something? You know, like snail bodies, snail shells, and a drink? I don't know. I don't know. The shells, the shells can't be like down in there, but maybe I should dig around a little bit and just make sure they're not hidden. Just, just nasty snails. Goodness, Dawn, you should be ashamed of yourself. Ingredients, snails. We could stop there, that's really all that matters. Water, salt, pepper, laurel cloves, citric acid. Couldn't taste any of that over the snail. Hey, these are keto friendly though, one carb. And that one carb comes from fiber. You can subtract that. This is a great snack if you hate things that are delicious. This part right here, the little, I don't know, feet, what do you call it? Like their little scooter, their little body, the thing they slide across the ground with, their little suction pad. I don't know what you call this. I don't know the anatomy of a snail. Like this part is like, kind of like calloused, you know, cause they've been probably dragging across the asphalt and stuff. And it it's almost feels like a tongue. Like, oh, ah, ah, just ah. You know how sometimes when you're eating a piece of steak and you just get a hold of that one piece that like there's a big old piece of gristle or a big old piece of like uncooked fat and you're like oh. Each one of these is that piece of steak. Why? Why would you eat this? I played football in junior high. This smells like the boys locker room. I'm going to tell you something right now. If being wealthy means having a refined enough palate to enjoy something like this, let me stay a poor man. If you wanna enjoy a snack similar to this, but on the cheap, just cut the rubber soles off of some old shoes, soak them in some dirty water and enjoy. Well, Don, thank you for one of the most disgusting things I could imagine putting in my mouth today. This was certainly something. Maybe one of these days you'll get me something delicious that's a mystery. I think I'll go in and prepare a nice dish for dinner tonight and surprise you. Hey, if you enjoyed this video, drop a like on it, share it with somebody, comment below. Don't be giving Dawn any more ideas. I just gotta, I gotta turn this on real quick again. I already, I already ended the video and throw that stuff away, but they, these things got an aftertaste that will not stop. They just linger. I'm gonna tell you that right now. And they sticky, they got everything sticky. My table, everything, it's like snail slime.